I'm Old Sneelock. Welcome to another episode of Old Sneelock's Workshop. I went down to Tractor Supply in Kalamazoo and picked up a Cutler Hammer 3 8 inch by 2 and a half foot leader hose. It's got a male fitting on one end and a female fitting on the other and it's just exactly what I need to put this thing together. All I need to do is take this female coupling and spin it onto that thread. I have the two hose fittings all set. This one has the Teflon tape on it and this one has and this one has pipe dope on the inside of the coupling. The fitting came with a pipe dope already inside of it. There's no way in the world I'd be able to put Teflon tape in there. This piece of hose is called a whip. It's for actually using on air tools to give them a little more flexibility on the end, but it worked for this job, so I'm going to use it. In case you're wondering, it's never a good idea to plumb a compressor to the wall in hard pipe with too much vibration. I just need to spin that fitting on there, tighten it up. There, good and snug. I take this swivel fitting, start the thread into the quarter inch T. And this one would take a 15 16 wrench, which I don't happen to have right here in my hand. So I'm going to use a nut rounder very carefully. Now let's see if we got a leak. Nope, looks like we're good. Crank the fitting in. We're at 60 PSI. Works like a charm. So now with the hose reel in place, I can drag an air hose clear across the garage. I can inflate a tire, run a plasma torch, run an air grinder, anything I want. And all I have to do is release the reel and it pulls the hose right back up. No more tedious hand coiling of that yellow hose. Well, probably still going to have it because if I want to even run full pressure, I'm going to run it off of that hose. If you have any suggestions for a new video, questions about today's video, or any of the other videos on the channel. Just drop a note in the comments below. You know, I read them all. Thanks for watching. Never realized.
realized how much traffic there was on this road until I started trying to take